Welcome to DX Hudoku training video number 21. In this video, we will introduce you to the Hudoku program used for playing and practicing Sudoku. Hudoku is free software under the GNU General Public License. Even though it is free, Hudoku is, in my opinion, the very best Sudoku program available on any platform. In this video, we will show you how to download and install the Hudoku program. We will also show you how to launch the Hudoku program and start playing. Let's begin. Launch your favorite browser and go to your favorite internet search engine web page. Enter the text Hudoku download and then hit the enter key. You will see the Hudoku as the first link found in the search results. Click on the Hudoku link. This is the Hodoku homepage. Notice the left menu in purple. The Solving Techniques page is very good. You may want to take a look at it later. But for now, click on the Download Menu item on the left. SourceForge is where you download the latest version of the Hodoku program. Click on the green Download button. Wait a few moments for the download to begin. You will most likely see a security pop-up from the browser asking you to keep or discard the download. Click on the Keep button. In the lower left, you will see the hudoku.msi file downloading. Wait for the file to finish downloading. Once the file is finished downloading, click on the little up arrow button. Then select Show in Folder from the pop-up menu. Use the mouse to right-click over the .msi file shown in the folder. Select the Install Menu item from the pop-up menu. Click on the Next button. Select the I Accept checkbox and then click on the Next button. Click on the Next button. Then click on the Install button to start the installation. You may see a pop-up asking you for permission to install the software. Once the installation is complete, undo the Launch Hudoku checkbox for now. Then click on the Finish button to complete the installation. Close the File Explorer folder window. Close the Browser window. Right-click over the desktop and select New Shortcut from the pop-up menu. Then click on Browse, Navigate to PC, then the C drive, and then Program Files x86 as shown. Then navigate down into the Hudoku folder, and then select the Hudoku.exe file and click on the OK button. You should now see the dialog box filled out as shown. Then click on the Next button to continue. And finally, click on the Finish button to create the shortcut on the desktop. You should now see the Hudoku program shortcut on your desktop as shown. Double click on the shortcut to launch the Hudoku program. Select the difficulty level as shown. Then click on the 2 6 icon as shown to create a new puzzle. Notice the possible candidates are automatically shown for you based on the givens. By having the computer handle the drudgery of identifying the possible candidates, you will quit using paper and pencil for doing Sudoku puzzles. Right-click over a cell and use the pop-up menu to select the value for the cell. Select the Make One menu item to select one as the value of the cell. Once you get good at using Hudoku, you will no longer want to do puzzles using paper and pencils again. In another DX Sudoku video, we will show you how to enter your own givens for an existing puzzle you have on paper.
What is so interesting about the Hodoku software is once you get used to using it for solving puzzles, you will do so much faster than you would do on paper. This is as far as we are going to go for solving this puzzle. Using the Hodoku program is a very much a different experience than solving puzzles on paper. In the later DX Hodoku videos, we will show you how to use additional features of the Hodoku program you will greatly appreciate and find invaluable in solving more difficult puzzles. This completes DX Hodoku training video number 21. Thank you for watching.